if they get knowledge of Rubble, but it's going to be a quick B entry. Not too easily done, though. A quick stop, indeed. So now this pressures EG to work towards this A site. Door is going to get open to revolving on the A site. Big paranoia out on the defense. And really, G2 is currently shutting down any push coming out from the Evil Geniuses, leaving now Superman alone. But he's not going to be able to go in the clutch against four players alive of G2. The Mollies, which is now cooking Jogamo. And that allows Leaf to swing out right there as he was trying to escape. Leaf was able to line up too quite quickly with Util on top of that. And once again, EG had to backpedal into the opposite direction. At least for now, though, there's only Valen that's playing it very passively to get information first so that G2 could play the numbers on a retake. Nature and Four and Shorty down to 12 HP. As he was trying to scale up here towards this A side. EG, the plan continues to try to finish towards the B side with 10 yep. seconds left on the clock. Prowler scale out, left. spotting nobody in, in the sight, and G2 Target is okay out. of giving this up. Spikes planted. Where are you? So there will be noise and pressure here as the revolving door gets hit on this C site. And again, trying to keep them back at bay, so it'll give a chance for the defenders to swarm back up here, come out from the B heaven side. There's that paranoia to initiate it. It's going to hit one, but Nature is playing the off angle. Almost got that one up to Jonah B, but the trades are great for G2 Whoa. once again. They want to contest it. A as they push it up towards the rubble. Nature gets popped. And once again, you lose that control on one extremity, you have no choice. You have to try to make a move now on the other end. And they know they've been pressured a lot for EG towards Mount at the beginning. And they're ready for B. They have eyes everywhere on the map right now. G2 is so ready. But Jogimo picked up the orb on the C site. So definitely, especially that, Nano Swarms came out preemptive, preemptively. Might give a chance here for Jaw to satchel in. But they've lost Apoc on the lurk. There you go, towards the sky, lands it onto Leaf, down to 20 HP. Jonah B lines up the two, entry quite easily. And there's a showstopper in retaliation from Icy. Means they're gonna creep up even slower. Uh oh, so much util being thrown here towards the gate side. It's countered back by a nightfall that gets information on three. So that's the call for EG to move inside B for a plant. And you know, off these timeouts, EG is not afraid of using these ultimates when they have a lore by. Look at the four pushes towards the spawn because of that information. We're moving behind enemy lines here for EG, but a rotate comes back from G2 out at the Hobbit door. Four players streamlining in, traded out to start things off, but EG takes the lead, at least in a situation. Head to head, out towards the heavens. Derek then answers back onto Valen. It's doable now for Jogimo and Derek of EG against Trent and Jonah P, who does have the pit. Forced to fight out against Jogimo, back towards the waterfall. The tap on the spike, the wall comes up, isolating one of the two players remaining of EG. Hot now being thrown out. Derek marks them both. Only has the sheriff, lands the first shot, and now it's ticking down on that spike. Derek hears the tap, swings out, and gets it! Icy, cold, shuts it down. A big start, it's quick on that A site. Even once again, Lurk denied on B. And as that momentum you thought was going to come back from EG from yeah. that drifty, it gets instantly stopped by G2's, again, forward position on the A-side rubble. At least there is a snake bite being dropped here at the drop area. The pressure coming in, Icy gets flooded from the left side by nature. Here comes the attempt of a plant, you heard. Valen coming out for the TP from the shadows to support quickly for G2. Coming out towards the drop. Oh. Spraying with the Odin. Superman falls, and once again, EG will have to try to go for a clutch. A two versus four. Snake bite on that spike, denying the first point. Leaf not opting to use his <laughs> lockdown yet. Everybody's just spraying across. Still being quite annoying with these doors. Nature finally gets the pick. A second one. Nature! Nature. A third! And he gets the ace! Towards the ace site. It's going to be open for a plan. Although, there's Util coming in. The oh. satchel's out from Icy, clears out, leaves a pop, but gets instantly traded out by nature. Then the frags are coming in left. favor of EG. Plat now planted. in, out for the tree side. Two players left alive for G2. And that's Leaf and Jonah P with barely any utility left. The only thing Leaf has here is Timmy the turret. He wants to use it with the door. Making sure though that he clears out the backup rubble. Let's see if this wall suits him. <laughs> Too many. Too many on Just both too sides. many. Surprise on every single door. Jonah is now alone. And with the money that you see in the bank currently for the rest of G2, he's definitely going to try to see 
the weapon. A counter showstopper on both ends. Who hits who? Wait! At least it's guns instead. Instant trades on both sides. Hat coming out to get information, and now it's thrown here by APOC. Knowing now that the A side is open, but Superman's trailing far behind still. Door closes, time wasted. Valen in the drop spot. Just around the corner is Nature. There's a first brace now hit oh, by the snake ouch. bite. He's fine. Managed to safe. find a spot where he's okay. Superman finally trying to go for a plant, but taps first. Trying to see if G2 is going to swing out, and they do. Managed to get a snake bite kill onto Derek. 45 seconds left. Door reopened now by Superman. 8 HP left. Dang. As they're going to try to pivot towards the B side. TP across, and now Nature cuts the rotation. There's that first and second, but instantly Trent trades it out. He attempts now towards the B site, now down. Throws out a smoke as Superman. Now plays inside of it and around. First contact will be Trent. There's that first, and instantly Whoa. there. Fallon sprays through the smoke to trade it right back. Paranoia also comes out here to counter out and hold the push. 20 seconds left on the clock. EG has to now move inside the site. Counter Nightfall out on the defensive side. Numbers are down even. Make that an advantage for EG. Flat now successful. You mentioned Jonah P being too far. And now he's going to have to try to retake it inside an attacking Viper's Pit. But now he has to difficult. think on his toes. No util to work with. And he just made some noise. So they know that he dropped down towards the rope as he walks in on what the utility of, of Z offered, but that's good enough. And the Haunt as well, getting so much information. Now Valen alone has a battle at least. Spraying back into smoke are both teams. It looks like EG decides to pull back. Oh. Towards the C side of 1v1, nice little snake bite. <laughs> Flushing out Leaf. So unfortunately he falls. And he gives a whole site open now for EG. A TP out from Valen, left. but it's a one versus four. Stopped right away. No plan needed as we tie up the game 6 6 on a half. A little bit. Is it going to be enough? Scoring first is Apoff, though. EG in the lead in a situation. Close to the traps. Also, a little high to go against the Satchels, but the Satchels will be denied by Apoff once again with the classic. G2 finally able to come back for trades. And also taking lead in the situations. Jogno wrapping around. As the hot misses him, he has a timing across. Leaf is low on HP, so is Trent. Now the jump spot. Do we see him here? Here's the reload! And it's enough here to bait Jogimo out and Trent to get the kill. Apoth avoiding his own season eight, stays alive for a bit, spamming through his own cage. Jogimo around the corner, beautiful hot coming out from Derek. That lines up two kills for nature to throw out the hat in for the last two. And there's no time left. The last two players of G2 are forced to fall back and save their weapons. Fall hitting. An icy in. <laughs> they put a snake by towards the waterfall. Somehow gets a second one. As Leaf finally is able to answer back. But that support was Spike already down. there from nature. See. Advantage still out for EG. As Valen has made it through the spawn. And he's going to try to get behind. The winning factor. While Leaf goes for the plant here at the default spot. Sees Nate. Nice little bait out. Also trying to win some time for Valen to execute this backstab. It works against Superman. They try to answer right back. But Derek is able to avenge his teammate. Back to a 1v1. Jogimo against Leaf. 54, 62 are the HPs. Has a turret to work with. So makes it a two versus one in terms of information and angles that could be watched here against Jogimo. Jogimo breaks it right away. Cleans down the 4K and around for Leaf. EG snowball of a couple of rounds here. Once they figure out how G2 plays. And it starts off with an outlaw by Superman. Contacts onto Icy. Heavily pressured another. Paranoia being thrown out, forcing Valen to TP away. And the G2 Leaf able to get that lurk. God, they're so ready for every push. For EG indeed. Except not for the rotate potentially towards the seaside. So Jogmo wants to try to get the contact, but bumps the ceiling. And now Valen's on the lurk, but gets stopped. Trying to pinch across, trying to get trades. They lost a spike in the process. Oh and they lost my. all of their fights for G2. They should be able to defend this. Well, EG's doing the same thing as G2 right now, being annoying with these revolving doors, so Nature's the one that's opening it up. Three outside sight, they gotta get in. Spike's planted in sight. But Icy pops out the showstopper. 
adding fear to EG, forcing out the rocket, avoiding it, then trying to push down to punish, but Icy stays alive. Now on the top of the boxes as EG, Derek is moving forward with the rest of the team. Out for the oh, kill! Oh, oh, with the drop! TP right after the paranoia, avoids a little bit of these bullets, and now with the beautiful haunt being thrown by Derek. Allowing Dragomo and Superman okay. to just shut down the initial push of EG outside of A. But Jonah P is still One up and alive. Remaining. So is Leaf to answer right back. They're given all the fights. They thought there's maybe enough damage done. A little antsy there. And G2 come out on top. Apoth, healthy. Still, though, low armor on this buy. And it's going to be the slow work from G2 as they clear everything. They know Apoth could be one with a wild lurk, that spot you're not expecting. So they ha they're using everything just to get a bit of ground here or make sure they can displace Apoth and find out where he is immediately. And he's jiggling and watching. Yeah. Nana Storm being thrown. He knows there's at least a KJ and there's that first one at 5 Spike HP left though. A. Again, it's not even looking towards Tree. Oh my gosh. And that... The gun is not even sticking out here. That was so close as Leaf walks behind, but he looks the wrong way. Behind. Clearing a lot of info. Oh, Superman, though. Now we commit. Nightfall on the attack. Dragon at half health as he's hit by that. Even the Han, and that's going to make it a little bit easier until I see that. Dragon gets the pick, but there you go. G2 stops the opportunity of EG seconds. to turn around over in their favor. Two more kills needed to close out the first map. Nature and Apoth world. hit even out on the attack. Rendering things a lot more difficult now for evil geniuses. They hear the drop, the wall comes down, Nature connects onto Leaf. Upgrades now into a Vandal. Both players on both teams virtually at the same health. Apoth trying to walk in, decayed now by the pit, avoids the first Snake Bite. Sprays across to try to get a timing. As he swings in, there's that first kill. A second one, easily done by Trent. Four in the round. They put G2. And it looked right away like G2 wanted to fight instantly. Spike planted. But it gets planted. Trent gets the pick off through the dome. As Apoth after the plant falls. Gecko Dizzy now being thrown towards the air to get information. And Leaf is quite good for those two kills swarming inside from that screens. Jogging low on HP with Superman. Player up against standing. a full roster, quite healthy of G2. Oh Trent with three in the round. Yeah. Two. It's a big dizzy that gets uh, a big blind out the Jogging Oh, aggressive. Tried to dash away, and there's Whoa. that push down. Punishing Superman. And at the same time, look at those bullet holes. They added a lot of pressure for G2 on the A side, so it almost looked like a pincer maneuver on all the Poison angles off. of the map. Spike down. Feels like Lotus early rounds all over again. Spike already down. Out towards yellow. Derek alone now. Towards the B site. Nature on the other side at A. Lee's Derek's able to fight back. Icy falls early. Recon guard to work with. Chance now for Nature to move back with him. So they could try to dwindle down the numbers of the defense of G2 towards his B site. Toward those spots, Derek runs out. Jonah P. Spike down, B. Is answered back by nature. 30 seconds left. He's clutched this before here, this IGL for EG. Jump spot, though, from Trent. Just saw him forcing out the paranoia. Information for nature to know there was two players there towards orange. He hears the turret. It's going to see him right past the window. Almost a spam. At least Timothy Turret gets the spam. Oh, my gosh. Superman falls. Nature 1v1. At least contacts on to Valen. Derek as well as Icy Falls. High tide, second cycle out. Bubble for a plant. Being denied currently by the Hunter's Fury of Trent. Connects and Apoch Falls. Low HP are Derek and Nature. And Jonah P's on that flank. And he avoided all that util. This is perfect now. There's that first one to fall. And Nature. At least gets Jonah P. But he's still up against Leaf and Trent. At 18 left in terms of health points. A tap on the spike, and Trent knows they have all the time in the world here. Silver lining, EG gets a plant. The lurk, though, denied. Whoa. As Icy gets the headshot on Superman inside kitchen. Some players playing inside the site, some playing pulse plants as Thrash is available for Icy for the retake. Nature holding towards the dice. A second one in the face of Trent. Valid answers back. And the Thrash is trying to find info. Oh, Jogma almost had that kill. But Val was able to save Icy. No post plant util. And a two versus three at a disadvantage for Ichi. Tap on the spike, the smoke, the deniability wow. off the sprays. Is waiting towards the B site. Swings out for the first. 
Apoth with the trade. Oh my god. Jonah P holding towards yellow and Jonah P getting the kill towards so yellow until nature is able to get two of his own. Superman in a clutch situation and Superman cannot be the hero this time. Jono <laughs> pushing forward though is able to get that pick onto Valen. And that's what we meant here. Maybe some of them will get detained, but it doesn't matter. At least you get the pit down. Now you can get also or the plant and then the pit yep. to play Pulse Plant from Jail. This. Now Jones spotting Leaf on the top. Dizzy being thrown out on the defense. G2 trying to move forward and together inside the pit behind the wingman. It's nice oh. for IC to get the first. Jogmo answers right back in a nice dog. wave on the, on the third of the round off the trend. And there is that lurk running out of bullets, but at least Jogimo is able to keep Jonah P in a tight spot where he can't get anything done. Nice spray in the end with the Phantom as the, the round play out as slow as possible. It seems like now they're moving up too. Knew where the thrash was coming from, so Derek gets the contact with the Hunter's Fury. It's quite interesting at the same time though, but we'll talk about that in a bit. Valen still alive at yellow, second in the round. TP's away now towards green. Second, second smoke being remaining. pinched from behind, but nature is able to reach that kill before. Yep. Apoth was able to turn around though. Get the plant. And now Jonah P is in a one versus three. Economy's not too great for G2, yet Jonah P still wants to make it expensive now against EG. Scaling up towards orange. High low contact here on the right side of the B site. And Superman's gonna get it. The site for a plant now for EG. Nature, once again, a great spot towards the dice, adds value into that. Blade Storm now available for Jogimo as he activates it and helps out the rest of the team on the Pulse Plant. Trent, though, has something else to say. Tying things up on a 3-3 situation with all three players of G2 now working towards the back of the A site. Jogimo back with the, A to, uh, with the Operator looking back towards A as a TP comes across at Jenny. Nature catchy one, sleeping and even two. Whoa. Valen's forced to be alone now. Easy one there with the operator in the end. With that responsibility, giving a chance for EG to have to fight evenly or able to fight evenly Ooh. on a retake towards the A site. Jogno scoring first. Valen then after with help from Trent. As so we're all around. Really not looking towards the verticality. Everything is really clean and good for G2. See the game so far, it's been one-sided domination out of G2 all along here on the second map of Icebox. Map here where EG came out with their one-off deadlock that really surprised G2. And now this time both of them coming out with new compositions. And G2 is ready for it all the way. Two more left alive now, Derek and Nature. Stinger close range, dropping the spike towards yellow. Wall up on the attack, trying to spray behind it are the players of G2 and Derek and Nature just trying to find this timing. A nice little double swing out from that smoke. Protection. Still on the ropes too. Oh, Valen already no. drops that. Dizzy did way too much. Two players are falling down, and that operator is all solo. Once again, hit by so much utility. As that operator one had zero remaining. value. Nor are the players. Last oh, one in. Jonah B with the kill. A flawless round to give the series to G2.